There could be more plastic than fish in the ocean by 2050 unless we do something. And while normally relying on your fellow humans to stop being terrible rarely works out, not all hope is lost. The Ocean Cleanup Project has an ambitious plan to remove 88,000 tons of plastic from the Great Pacific Garbage Patch by using a pool noodle-like boom called System 001. The first step is a two-week trial taking place about 260 miles off the shore of San Francisco. And if everything goes according to plan, they'll tow the noodle another thousand miles to start its main mission cleaning a nearly invisible sea of plastic debris that is at minimum the size of Texas. Wind and waves will push System 001 into a U-shape. Then it will slowly drift along on its own while a 10-foot long skirt hanging below it will scoop up pieces of plastic as small as a millimeter in size. After it has collected enough debris, smaller boats will gather the plastic and take it to shore for recycling. During the trial, the whole thing will be monitored very closely to make sure it extracts plastic but not plankton and other crucial marine life. It will also be an important durability test. The boom will need to survive rough seas and storms so that it doesn't become plastic waste itself. If it makes it out of the trial phase, the cleanup system will still require close monitoring for the first six months. But the hope is that, eventually, autonomous vehicles can do the heavy lifting. Even if the Ocean Cleanup Project is successful, this will only put a small dent in a huge global problem. There are an estimated 165 million tons of plastic in the ocean today, and that's expected to balloon to a billion tons by 2050. At best, System 001 will be able to extract about 55 tons of plastic from the ocean per year. However, the group hopes that by deploying 60 more systems, they can remove about 50% of the Pacific Garbage Patch plastic every five years. We'll see you tomorrow with more Engadget Today.